Bad dream. Terminal 3 had good reviews. It was a nightmare. No, I think I got it. All right. Anyway, I'm playing Fallout 4. Not really that action packed today, but it's funny nonetheless. I'm teaching. Excuse me. I'm in the Diamond City School Mr. Zawicki. right now. I'm talking to Mr. Zawicki and his robotic assistant. 165. No, no, no. It is 180. I see your parents are not practicing your multiplication tables with you. Family. It is important, yes? This thing called love. Whatever. Love won't keep your family alive. Sometimes you need to be hard. Oh, that's what she said. I see. I have one more question before you leave. It's not another quiz. I just... I don't get to talk to many adults. This love I hear about, do you think you can have it for someone, even if the two of you are very, very different? Nope. If you love someone, Wait, wait, Hold wait. on to them. This is confusing. Tomorrow you wait, might robots not have, have emotions? I, I thought there were thank you. plain AI. Let me make up my mind about something. This is confusing now. Your math scores this year have been excellent. You really hey, should Edna. consider joining the science. Mr. is the teacher here. Yeah. He's a wonderful. I'd rather be a I mean, security officer. Knowledgeable? That way I can hit people who deserve it. That's, well, I suppose enthusiasm. Hey, have Mr. Zawicki. Got Just something on my mind. Disrupt. Go ahead. Appreciate it. After Tommy stuck me with you, I was expecting to hate your guts. Not you only do. because you've agreed to pick up me contract, but because I was waiting for you to order me around like oh, yeah. hired hell. I was now, so far, you've been treating me like a friend. Hallie, you've been damn near nice to me. Hmm. Now, I don't mean you. to sound ungrateful, but your kindness is starting to make me wonder if there's anything I learned in the combat zone. It was that nobody does things for other people without expecting something in return. Your that robot is like, that really neat. You don't even come close to the losers that pollute the place. I spent three years living at the combat zone. Smelled like puke and piss. But I called it home. I was making a few caps. Had me own bed to sleep in and three hot meals a day. Then the raiders took over the place. You know that lot. They aren't exactly what you'd call the gentle type. After they moved in, if you didn't keep looking over your shoulder, you were liable to get sucker punched or robbed. Or worse. Didn't take me long to learn that I had to put my hard-earned caps to good use. Buying friends was essential to making life easy. So, I guess I'm waiting for you to hand me a bill. You know what I mean? Don't be ridiculous. I already got what I was expecting from Tommy. Yeah, sure. But how long until you decide that he didn't give you enough? That's what I'm wondering. I'll tell you what. Give me some time and I'll think of something I can do to repay you. I'm not a rich girl, but I'm sure we can agree on something. After all, what are friends for? Hey. What you need? You know that radiation yes, of course. is why Brahmin have two heads? Um, what do you want? It's true. You're here. You I think we need some time away from each other. I'll head out, but I'm not gonna lie to you and say I'm happy about it. If you change your mind, you know where to find me. Oh, right. Thank you. Just don't disrupt the class. Oh, don't mind me. I can... I'd be glad to talk to them. Marvelous. Stop by whenever class is in session. I'll just stop what I'm doing and turn the class over to you. Hello, Katie. This will be a rare treat for the kids. Looking forward to what you'll have to say. When your numbers get over 10, you carry the extra to the next column. First down the job. And I'm into a wall. 
Hello, Mr. Wall. Nice paint. Anyway. <clears throat> Someday, I'm going to check out the Commonwealth. <laughs> if my grin lets me. Action! Would you like to tell the students you one of your stories? Found him. Thanks, mister. Hey, pal. I, I was like so worried so about him. You're welcome, by the way. Hi, mister. You sounded really weird when you said that. I hope that came from a girl. Well... Bringing back your cat almost got me killed. But Ashes didn't get hurt, right? Anyway, yeah. Mom says I can give you this. Ashes! A piece of... Bad kid. Wait, why does the little girl have a I huge... I was so worried about you. Hey, Katie. And I bet Would you Mom's like to tell the students one of your stories now? Yeah. It was a dark and stormy night. What topic I should I avoid? Nothing with excessive violence. And I'm sure they'll have lots of questions. I'd be glad to. Wonderful. The kids are so excited. Children! Children, listen up! We have a guest today who is going to tell us stories about the Commonwealth. Did you ever fight a Death Claw? One of the Minutemen helped me kill one once. Cool! What happened? Raiders surrounded the museum where my friend Preston was holed up. I had to kill them all with my bare hands. Just your bare hands? Really? Preston showed me where to find some power armor I could fix. Power armor! Wow. When the Death Claw crawled out, I grabbed one of the raider's pistols, but it only had three bullets. I would have run away. I was hurt pretty badly, but Preston and I finally killed it. Wow. Thank you so much for that story. Children, say thank you. Thank, thank you. you. And we have a thank you gift for you. Here. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. You should check it out. It's got a lot to offer these days. Maybe someday. At the rate we're working these days, maybe sooner than later. Hard work pays off. And you guys are maintaining the vault, right? Trying to, at least. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Watch yourself. Hey there. So, we got a new visitor today. Don't say anything, but man, I'd love to be out there. If you want to leave, why don't you just go? Wish it was that easy. It's scary leaving the vault. And the Commonwealth? It's all so unpredictable. It takes some preparation. I'd learn how to use a gun and be ready to use it before I went out there. I've never even touched a gun. Now, I can't even say if our security has seen any real combat, but with the hours we're working these days, I'm not even sure where I'd find the time to practice. Screw work. Do what you want. I wish. They say it's all the moving parts that have us working around the clock these days. Structurally, I guess 81 is still pretty sound. Vault Tech sure knew what they were doing when they set these places up. Well, I don't want to keep you, and I gotta get back to work. Maybe I'll see you around. <clears throat> if only the Commonwealth wasn't so dangerous, I'd love to see more of it. Careful, outsider. 
Another outsider? What they let you in for? What's with the attitude? I don't trust outsiders. We didn't need your help before, we don't need it now. The Overseer never should have opened up the vault to your kind. Well, aren't you a ray of sunshine? You think you're funny? That's exactly why outsiders don't belong here. <laughs>